Hey, what is up guys? This is Roy and welcome to a brand new video on this channel. So today, Chandan, Chandan from Mumbai, he just sent me a mail. Let me show you. Focus, okay. So he asked me, I have a Sony Home Theater System 5.1 and I want to convert that to a Bluetooth. Is it possible? If yes, then how? So in this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can transfer your old audio system into a awesome Bluetooth audio system. So let's get started guys. So this is the first Bluetooth audio receiver dongle I bought. It's powered by USB and it has a audio out. But this kind of dongle cost you around 2 to 3 dollar and the audio quality is really really bad. So I don't recommend you guys to buy this kind of dongle. This is the next Bluetooth dongle I bought. It cost me around 400 rupees, not about six dollar. It has a inbuilt mic in it. Also has a battery, and you can charge using this micro USB port. This is 3.5 mm audio input. You can put your headphone, earphone, whatever you want. This is the power button. Press and hold to turn it on. The audio quality of this dongle is little better than this one, but still the audio quality sucks. I don't like the audio. It Next, I bought this audio receiver board from Banggood. It cost me around $7, but the quality is really, really awesome. And you also get a remote with this board. This board not only just support Bluetooth, but also support HD card. You can put your SD card here. Uh, you can put pen drive. This is the power input for the board. This is the three point audio out and this is the microphone and here you also get mode play next back and equalizer button and this is the IR sensor for remote. Now I'm going to test all of this dongle on my home theater system and show you the sound quality. And then Insert the three point mm here. Now, this is the one connecting. So it's connected. I've seen you. I've patrolled these empty thoughts before, but I'm crying. The dangle sound is a little bit low, and let me show you the range of the dangle. It's, it's here. It's cutting the sound from 2-3 foot. Yeah, it's from here. It's only 2-3 feet. The range is only 2-3 feet, guys. Now testing the second Bluetooth audio receiver. Turn it on. Okay. Now let me connect with it. Yes, it's connected. So we used to see a uh -huh. Do you remember? A fallen man with no escape. It seems he lives in yesterday, uh-huh. If you play, play away, but I'll forgive you once again. In the room, I can play from other room. So, guys, the range is near about 30 to 40 feet. It's good. Now, time to test this Bluetooth audio receiver board. Uh, putting a micro SD card here. Uh, pen drive and then this is the power power it on this is the audio uh, here we have some play pause button uh, okay let's play
So this is the Bluetooth mode. The Bluetooth device is connected successfully. So let me take into my room again. So I am near about finish editing my video and this statement. The courier guy give me this statement. I think there is a Bluetooth audio receiver inside it. So let's unbox this pack and see what's inside. So I bought this product from gearbase.com. Oh, look like kind of same. And there is something else. So what you need to do, you need to plug this here. And like this and plug this inside your speaker. And you can play music from these various devices. That's not cool. Now time to check the audio quality. I connected this Bluetooth receiver with my earphone and the sound quality like okay the sound quality is little better than this one but still there is no bus I think this is the best this is the best bang for box Bluetooth audio receiver you can buy this video turned out a little bit longer than I expected now on the back side I have two five point on home theater system one is from LG another is kind of broken it is from creative focus yeah it is from creative and I need to fix the woofer here and then I'm going to show you guys how you can turn it into a 5.1 channel bluetooth speaker and also this one two channel bluetooth audio receiver board and this one also a two channel bluetooth audio receiver technically you can't transfer 5.1 channel audio over bluetooth but if you want to get audio out from front as well as rear speaker you can use this kind of audio splitter then you can insert your speaker audio in here and attach with your bluetooth receiver now you can listen audio from four speaker the center speaker will not work but if you want to listen sound from all of the five speaker, you can add us another audio splitter here and put your two uh, audio input here. 
The Bluetooth device is ready to pair. The Bluetooth device is connected successfully. So I have another home theater system. This is LG uh, 5.1 home theater system. Uh, if you have this kind of home theater system, you may find a audio input in front like here or maybe on the back. This is the left and right audio input for this home theater system. So guys, I think this 5.1 channel Bluetooth is working. So I'm playing this music from this phone. Okay. And off it. So the Bluetooth signal is received by this Bluetooth audio receiver. And I'm sending this two point audio signal by this wire to the back. And this LG home theater converted into a 5.1 channel audio out. This is speaker working. This one is also working. This one, central speaker, also working. Right speaker, also working. And this one, also working. This is over. If you have a home theater system that doesn't have any audio input, then it will be really hard to convert it into a Bluetooth music system. You have to open your home theater system and find a 5 volt source to power the Bluetooth receiver and then you need to find the preamp. It is a bit tricky and it varies from device to device. But if you find it, you just need to solder the Bluetooth audio out to the amplifier. That's it. You guys always ask me from where I get all of these cassettes. Basically, I buy it from ebay.com. Sometimes I buy it from amazon.in. I buy a lot of things from Banggood. Then I also buy from Gearbest and I also buy AliExpress. I go through all of these sites and try to grab the best deal. Compared to other websites, Gearbest and Banggood shipping is really, really fast. Generally, I get my product delivered within a week or two. And this is the Bluetooth receiver I used in this video. So I'm going to show you how I buy it. I exactly need two more of these modules. So I'm going to buy two of them. Uh, then shipping, air parcel, register. Okay, add to cart. Now I have a coupon. I have a coupon 6% affiliate. See, apply. I get 0.83 cent discount. Okay, now I'm going to pay. Check out with PayPal. Yes, this is my address. Okay, log in here. Log in. Continue. Yeah, I successfully ordered the product. Yeah. If you guys have any question, any suggestion, anything regarding this video or regarding anything, make sure you comment in the comment section below. And if you want to check all of this product shown in the video, the link is in the description below. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Hope you like this video. If you like it, make sure you smack a big thumbs up on this video. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, make sure you subscribe for upcoming more video like this. And there is a notification button near to subscribe. And make sure you click the notification icon so whenever I upload a new video, you get notified. I don't know. I'm looking, guys. Uh, there is another one. So, guys, that's it for today. Meet with you on my next video. Till then, bye bye, tata, and peace.